This is Doug Barnberg and welcome back to another Tips and Tricks and today uh, it's a little chilly but we're out here on the water and we're going to show you some of these new features of the new Humminbird Solix update. Uh, how to use it and uh, how to get more out of your unit. One of the first things is you've got this tabs here. Um, with NEMA 2000 you have your motor. Uh, I'll turn the key on and we can see that. We can see our talons, our iPilot link, our GPS heading information, our temperature information, and our menus. This is going to be one of the thing I call it the Fab Five. Uh, you got your favorite views right here. If you want to pin it to hold it on the side, you just tap the pin button down here. I've got chart, chart, side imaging. I've got the four-way, the down imaging. I mean, all you got to do is push a button there. Wow, look at them fish right there. Bingo, we pulled on top of it. Uh, side imaging's right there. Uh, quick, easy 2D sonar. I mean, at the tip of a finger. I like the chart chart. I like to zoom out and zoom in when I'm looking around here. Um, that's my Fab Five. And then you have your next favorite five. Um, and I'm gonna show you how to do this. If you go to views and We'll just go through here, look for something we don't have. Uh, we've got a three-way here. We'll pull it up. All you have to do to add it is you've got this plus down here, or even it's a chart. All I got to do is push and hold, and it puts that favorite view on top of that. So that's how you set up your, your favorite views. You've actually got the 10 Fab Fives, uh, 2 times 5. It's got number 1, number 2. What I'm looking at is I might do this for pre-fishing and tournament fishing. You don't use the same thing all the time uh, in this situation. And you could have your five favorites uh, that you're going to use during the tournament and then the five favorites you may use during pre-fishing. Or you can set up your favorite ten. This is uh, waypoint information. Uh, there's your next waypoint, your heading, prop speed. Uh, we're just fired up here. And cruise it along a little bit. You can see our heading. Um, there's our iPilot link information. It's right here. If you want to control your iPilot link, talents. Watch this. Talons are going down, talons coming up. Got your different anchoring modes here. Got your standard, soft bottom, rough water. You can turn on the light, uh, the light settings, low. You can have white colored, we'll put a blue. There's high, back. I mean, it's all right here, easy to get to. I mean, this new operating system is going to make it so much easier to operate your Humminbird Solix units. Um, I love this Fab Five. I mean, if you want to go to your four-way, you still got your good old-fashioned two-finger tap and hold full screen. If you want to take it off, you can take it off. I mean, um, there's some there's some really cool things. One of the cool things is the new home menu with a back back screen. Um, there's two pages of tools. There's files here. Um, this is where your software update is. Uh, images. There's your images. These widgets going to make it so much faster and easier. Uh, to, to look up stuff, go back to home. Um, what else did we miss here? Come back to the top. Uh, images. This is what's, what's cool because of your home screen your wallpaper. Now you now have wallpapers. You got all these different images. If you want to set a new wallpaper, man it's cold up here. Cypress trees. That's gonna make me feel a little bit warmer. 
So we're gonna think we're in South Louisiana, hit it back, come to our home screen. Now you have the nice cypress trees in the background, make you feel warm on a cold day. Your sun and moon charts, uh, 525, we've got a couple hours uh, left to stay on the water. Tells you your moon cycles. Uh, we're in the third quarter right now. Daylight remaining, 154. Um, these Solixes are packed with so many things uh, that you can do. You got your alarms, you can set right there. Your GPS information is going to show you your status of your GPS. You can see your, your reception strength and everything. Satellites are popping up there. Uh, trip log. I mean, if you set this stuff up, you can use it. It's simple and easy to get to. You still have your master menu. You can hit menu twice. We'll just jump out of here real quick. We'll go to our deal here. You still have your menu tab. Brings up your express menu with your settings there. Um, hit it again, and it brings up the master menu. You're, this is very similar to what we've already explained before. Um, you got all your different sonar settings, um, your 2D chirp, your down imaging. You, I mean, it's all right there at your fingertips. Chart, your network. I mean, you can go to network information and see all your stuff that's on your network. Got the Solix 10 and the Solix 12, my 360, Ethernet, my two Ethernet switches. It's all right there at my fingertips. If you need to restore defaults, you have you, you can restore your sonar, your chirp sonar settings, the chart, radar, nav data, target, or you can restore everything. Um, information about your vessel, um, general information, navigation. Um, one of the new things is this fuel tab. I've got, to, I've got to do this. You can fill up, you can set your thing. If you're NEMA 2000 and you've got your fuel used and your fuel economy, it's all going to show up right here uh, with your information. So that's new. But uh, that's kind of the overview. We're going to let you learn more. We're going to do more videos, but uh, wanted to show you this new operating system that makes it so much easier you've got the especially the sidebar man that is going to be awesome so check it out download it at hummingbird.com uh, it's free to it's free to download just go to the support tab software updates you can download it put it on an SD card you'll have to you download it uh, extract the files once you because it's in a zip drive but once you do that, you put it on an SD card, put it in your unit, upload it, like the video that we did prior to this, and it shows you everything that's available. Uh, I mean, it'll upload, and you'll get all these cool features added to your Solix unit from Humminbird. Now, here's something cool and new with the new update, is the new ability to turn your 360 on right with a fingertip easy you don't have to go through the menu you just tap and it's right there that's all it takes now here's one of the other th cool things is now maximized if you go to full screen you're going with the width with your 360 imaging giving you more more screen display to show the data that's available to you You can isolate your sweep there. You can do your front, your left, your right. Oop, there's your color palettes. Or you can go rearward with just one tap of a button there. Quick and easy. You talk about a one boat network. With this new sidebar and the ability to, to quickly and easily do any of my functions. Uh, my talon, my motor, my iPilot link, all of it here, real quick and easy, is going to make it so much easier and faster. That's why the Minn Kota Humminbird package is so awesome and amazing because of the ability to work together. My talons, my iPilot, my Minn Kota Ultrax, it's all working together.
thank you for tuning in to another set of tips and tricks and get your one boat network and get the new Celex update and get it on your unit because it's an amazing tool to help you be more efficient when you're on the water so you can ultimately catch more fish.